Well, the latest numbers are not adding up to really any progress when it comes to the pandemic. The latest positivity rate for Erie County's orange zone is 7%. In the yellow zone, the rate is actually higher at 7.5%. And Western New York as a whole is a region currently sitting at 5%. And we don't get our current numbers down. Portions of Erie County could be placed in a red zone. That could happen as early as tomorrow. You can see what that would mean here on this chart among the changes only essential businesses would be allowed to stay open. And the owner of a popular retail chain here in Western New York says he will not survive another shutdown. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Jeff Rusak takes a look at the situation facing the Buffalo store. The holiday shopping season starts this week, and with shops forced to close earlier this year, businesses, especially small local ones, need the next few weeks to pack a punch financially. Staring down another round of closures, owners of places like the Buffalo store are terrified of Erie County entering a red zone. If it wasn't for this time, there's no point in being open, period. I mean, you might as well close up shop, go, go off and, you know, file bankruptcy. Because at this point, if we don't stay open, I can't promise another future for next year or the, or the year after that. It would take a lot to recover. Nathan Rose says they're doing all they can to stop the spread of COVID-19 and keeping their doors open. He feels stores like his aren't a significant contributor to the spread of the virus. You know, you can go to these big box retailers in a state of, you know, red, and you can basically bump into people, have lines out the door, but it's not safe to come into a business that has plenty of open room, that's a small business that's fighting to survive. Somehow that doesn't add up to me. It's not just the decorations changing here at the Buffalo store. Pretty soon, some of the things they're selling could be a little bit more essential. But what if we started selling these essentials? Not only would it help you know, keep some of the employment uh, rolling, but also would help uh, those in need to have maybe a, a location that they feel a little more comfortable with. To keep his employees working and two of his five stores open, Moreau says the Buffalo store will start to sell essentials like toilet paper and hand sanitizer during a red zone. Parts of Erie County are still on pace to become a red zone. Jeff Rusak, 7 Eyewitness News.